reached the conference finals for just the second time since moving to Atlanta last season. One of the surprises of the 2021 playoffs. They made Nate McMillan their head coach on a full-time basis in the offseason and signed a couple of big contracts to retain John Collins and Trey Young, whose rookie max extension could be worth as much as $207 million if he makes an All-NBA team this upcoming season. And speaking of Trey, he just sat down with our Christian Ludlow. You became our long-awaited playoff villain since the last time I saw you, but mm -hmm. you're going from the hunter now to the hunted. How does that shift your approach? Uh, I mean, it's it's kind of the approach we, we've had all along. I mean, we, we know we're underdogs. Uh, we actually kind of still feel that way. Um, but at the same time, we're always going to have that mentality to go out and play hard and, uh, and, uh, and try to win. And, we compete at a high level, and we have that same mindset every every game. Do you like it that way, the the, the underdog? Yeah, I mean, for me personally, yes. I mean, <laughs> I've, I've been that been that underdog. I mean, my whole my whole playing career since high school, and uh, I mean, I think it's a, a good thing to have that little chip on your shoulder. I thought I was going to be asking you about your first return to MSG, but we saw recently you've already made <laughs> a return to MSG. First, yeah. how was that? I, it, was, it was fun. It was fun. It was a little different for me, a little acting. So it, it was fun, uh, different for me, but it was uh, a lot of booze for sure. It didn't arena. come off as acting. It looked yeah. very much, you looked very natural. Oh, okay. Yeah. Appreciate it. Like, I, uh, in your element. Yeah, I was, yeah. okay. Yeah. I guess a little bit. A little bit. <laughs> because you will be going back on Christmas Day. How much are you looking forward to potentially spoiling Christmas in New York? Uh, I'm looking forward to it. Um, I mean, playing on Christmas has been uh, something I've always wanted to do. Uh, I've watched Christmas Day game since I was a kid and uh, to be a part of it this year is going to be an, an unreal feeling and uh, my goal is to win on that day so uh, it's going to be fun. To have signed your own contract extension to see a couple of your teammates do so as well how much freedom does that give you in knowing that at least three of your five starters mm -hmm. are locked in for the future here in Atlanta? Yeah I mean it's, it's very good it's very important um, for guys going into the season in the right mental state, focus really mainly on just basketball and not necessarily like anything else. And um, it's it's a great feeling to have, and everybody, um, it's, it's awesome to see everybody getting what they deserve. And uh, I'm just really looking forward to competing with these guys for more years and uh, seeing where this goes. Were you watching the NBA Finals? Uh, a little bit, a little bit. I, I don't like. Uh, I don't like looking. I want to be a part of it. I want to see see it. Uh, I feel like I, this year we were really close, and I don't really, I didn't really want to watch it until uh, now being a part of it. Um, that's that's my main goal. Knowing you, I thought that you may avoid watching, knowing yeah. you were two wins away. Yeah, very. That, that's that's what it was for me. A first signature shoe. Mm -hmm. That's pretty exciting to step on the floor in this upcoming season in a shoe with your own name on it. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, no, it's. Uh, I'm excited. I'm excited about uh, now not being able to play in my own shoe. From here on out, it's going to be a, a dream come true, and uh, I'm not going to hold that lightly. Uh, every time I play, I want to. Uh, I know I'm representing a lot more than just myself, and uh, I want everybody to, that puts on this shoe to, to feel the way I do, and, and want to go out there and have fun. I'd like to feel it. All. Can I get a pair? Oh, yeah. Or can we? We'll set that. All we'll right, set cool. that. We got it. <laughs> Thank you. Good to see you. We'll Good talk to you soon. You. Appreciate it. Uh.